Hope that makes sense. Okay. Are we ready? Here we go. <clears throat> Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Last time around, we basically wasted two hours fighting a double frog boss, and then we started doing story, and here we are in a new area called the Forest Array. Now, taking a look at it, <clears throat> I'm honestly wondering what we can do. So, meditate. Oh, we already did that. Oops. I'm assuming this is where we need to go. The big tower right there. See that? It says, uh, examine. The array feeds into that central tower. Maybe that's where we'll find answers. Okay. But we need to find a way into the central tower. And as you can see, there seem to be quite a, an amount of things around here to investigate. And I don't think we can really... Like, that blue stuff we can't walk in. We die if we touch it. So this whole area, this direction, would be a no-go for now. I don't think there's any way for us to get rid of this stuff, right? No. So this is, you can't go through any of this blue stuff. We have a bench just sitting here out of nowhere. Shall we customize our lightsaber? Because I think we got a new lightsaber customization pattern or something. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we did. Let's see. New. Diligence was the new one. Alright, we'll equip the new one. Diligence. So we have a new configuration here, right? Okay, cool. <clears throat> there we go. Materials. So we can do different colors again. Do we have any new... Oh, wow. You can actually color the whole thing now. Look at that. That's interesting. You do green. You do blue. Let's do a white. I like that. The white color. I actually really like that. We'll do white and blue. With metallic accents. Doomnium. Doomnium. Okay. There's our new lightsaber. How exciting. Alright. So here we've got what appears to be a platform that lets us go this way. Probably where we're headed. Again, we can't go through any of this blue stuff. Oh, he could scan this for us at least. Tell us what it is. Let's see what he says. No cutting through this stuff. Robo or oh, Kobo barrier. An impenetrable barrier of highly magnetized dust like matter. Standard manipulation is ineffective against the structure, proving resistant even to lightsaber strikes. And then sadly can't do anything here. It looks like eventually we will be able to go over there and climb up there. But there's no way we're going to reach that from here. Now it looks like, could you think we could re reach and grab that there? I think so. Do you see that above us? But I don't think we can reach that now. I think we could eventually reach up and grab the ceiling and kind of platform over. Oh my god, look how close I am. But I can't reach it. Nope very close, but I can't seem to reach it yet. Alright. So we're just gonna go ahead and do, uh, do the platforming that obviously the game is intending. It's the platform we just pushed down there. Not ants. There's microscopic magnetic metal pieces that seem to almost be sentient. Look, there's an item there I can't grab yet. I guess we have to clear all this stuff out first. So we have to find a way to clear the blue Power's out. stuff. This place must have been abandoned and forgotten. She didn't forget. All these years later, she never gave up on her mission. We can't let her down. Here we go. Do -do -do -do. Oh, how convenient that slid right into place to hold on to another handhold. Very nice, right? <laughs> how good. I guess we're going up. Oh, anything down or nope? That's deadly. You can't go right. Going up. That's a large bird. <clears throat> I think that creature is trapped. I can't cut it free. Uh. Let's pass under it for now. There's a way to free the bird, possibly later. Okay. 
activate. Here we go. All right, so we got a shortcut. So we don't have to come back up here again. We go up and down, right? Giant enemy crafts. I wish someone would make a Star Trek game that plays like Gears of War or Uncharted. Hmm. That'd be interesting, but I don't necessarily know if Star Trek has ever been so action-based. You know what I mean? Even like the J.J. Abrams movies. Although they did add some action sequences. Jade, welcome back. He says his computer updated, so he's back now. Sounds good. Okay. <clears throat> well, still can't go down. Nope. There's the bird. Go in here. Nope. That's not opening. We're doing this. Going under the bird. What's for dinner? I think we're gonna have. I think today we're actually having turkey dogs and Nathan's onion rings. I think that's what we're having for dinner. I'm not exactly sure. My oh shit! Let's find another map. Might be able to help you later. <laughs> That was close. You seriously gonna scan this? Ugh. Sheds. Epic moltings. The piazza reigns over the skies and plains as one of the Kobo's apex predators. Those are its moltings. You. El Grey Zoro says, do you think we'll get a Star Wars game not featuring Jedi, but a bounty hunter in open world doing battles and smuggling? That'd be neat. Didn't they didn't they have an intention of making a game like that at one point and it got canceled or something? Oh shitty ass! Oh son of a fuck! I'm in big troubles. Oh, I'm in big trouble. That's up. Uh, I'm pretty sure they were making a game like that at some point. Were they not? I swear they were. And I think it got canceled or something. All right, there's a shortcut. Shortcut door unlocked. <clears throat> okay. Oh shit, oh shit. Something around here has a big appetite. Oh, what? It missed. And then I got hit. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Another locked door. Ah. Ah. Man. Star Wars 1313? Yeah, right? They were. They were making a game that wasn't supposed to be Jedi focused and it somehow just got cancelled. I don't know what actually happened. Huh. It was going to be gritty and mature rated. Hi. I rolled and he hit me anyway. I rolled and it, he grabbed me anyway. The grab went further than my dodge. Yeah, I don't know. The combat in this game is very, very wonky. Meaning, it doesn't feel as precise as you think they intended it to be. Like, you can tell they, they think it's more precise than it is. It's just not precise. It's very... Kind of all over the place. Like, you can't actually tell what's going to work. You can't tell the timing of, of dodges and stuff. Even the animations don't look smooth. <clears throat> So I'll get chopped up as I dodge. That's great. <clears throat> I pressed parry. What, oh, dude? I said it just doesn't it doesn't feel good and this is coming from someone who is literally playing Elden Ring as I play this game it just doesn't feel very good it feels like very wonky
do one attack and you can't parry. What even happened there? I don't even know. It's so weird. It's like you go for one hit, and he does two. See that? This stance is so weird. I want one strike. Do two. And now you commit to two, even though you only press the button once. Odd. I've never seen tech like this before. And I scrapped some serious machines on Braca. I see an area over there. Do you think we could jump to it? I think we might be able to. Oh, we've also got an area here. So is this optional stuff? I think it is, because I think they wanted you to go up. But I think I can go other ways. See? Wait! Invisible wall. Oh, that's well designed. Alright, let's try this then. <clears throat> so what are we doing here? Oh, there's an item. Can we jump up? Yes, okay, there's an optional hidden item here. I just love that the game has invisible walls and you can't tell where they are, so you're just destined to fall and there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> well, I got a nice upgrade. What did we get? This is a... Uh, oh! I got a whole level of a uh, skill point experience. That's cool, I guess. Where does this take us now? This was the other door that was locked. Yep. Okay. Not really a shortcut. It's just basically you're unlocking uh, the door for the, the optional item. John says, I found the single blade does a, a bit more damage and split blade is good for crowd control. Jade says, Star Wars is okay now. I'm not sick. All right, cool. <clears throat> you're not getting sick from the... I see, from the frame rate problems. I see. That's good to hear, Jade. I'm glad you're not. <clears throat> Hello, American MAGA Undertaker. I'm doing all right. How are you today? down there. Probably a puzzle. Puzzle of some sort. Got an item over here. Oh, we've got a diligence switch now. So that's more lightsaber customization. Here's another invisible wall. Look at this. The invisible walls are out of control in this game. They Again, they want it to be like Elden Ring or Dark Souls, but then they have all these invisible walls where you can't go. It's so stupid. We've seen this tech before, just not on this An scale. orb amplifier. So the orb can create a laser that will kill that vine stuff. Okay. But if I walk into it? It doesn't even affect me. What the heck? It gets rid of the, the, the plants, but it doesn't affect me in any way. Shall we see if I want to level up here? Is the FPS better? It's still kind of choppy. It's it's sometimes smooth and sometimes it's dipping. And At this point, I've kind of given up on caring about the FPS. I'm just going to kind of ignore it. I mean, I don't think they're ever going to fix the game, quite frankly, on console. I think it's always going to run like shit. So I'm not going to... I'm going to stop mentioning it. There's no real point. You know, how many times you want to beat the dead horse? You know? <laughs> uh. So anyway, survival... I had already upped my health. What's this one? Hold B to automatically evade incoming melee attacks. You just hold it. Cal recovers additional life when using a stim. I think we should get that. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Improve stim formula. Okay. Did you see his uh, his poncho was going crazy right there for no reason? Uh. Why can you wait a minute? Why can they stand it? They 
can stand fine in the blue stuff. It doesn't affect them, but it affects me only. Isn't that kind of weird? Why are the, why are the creatures immune to it here? No, I can't jump up. Can I climb this? Yes. Oh, I see it. I nice swing. Here we are. Platforms over there, but I don't think they necessarily lead to anything from what I can see. Cut. No way we're crossing that. It's still breathing. So I have a shortcut. Nothing here. No, not that I can see. I'll go this way. All right. Goldfish says it's discriminatory. The enemies are immune to asbestos, but you aren't. Is that what we're going with? with? It's asbestos? I don't think about it. <laughs> I don't think it's asbestos. Okay. There's tons of it. Look at this asshole. That's what I wanted to do. <laughs> I, I only had the reflecting ability with this this lightsaber, not this one. So I was able to reflect it back and kill him from a distance, which is pretty funny. Casanova, no, I'm probably not playing LEGO 2K Drive. I, I got this game to play. I've got Elden Ring to continue, and we got Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom starting Friday. I, I don't see myself playing four or five games a month at this rate, so uh, probably not. <clears throat> This looks optional. No. All the critters around the array are pretty riled up. Could be the dust in the air. Imperial patrols probably don't help either. Maybe this is not optional. Maybe this. Oh, no, this is optional. That's definitely an upgrade. A bile maw den. Oh shit. What's a bile maw? I think we're about to find out. <clears throat> Confusion, major fauna. Hold right bumper and press B to confuse large creatures. They'll help attack if no hostiles are near. Oh no, they'll attack Cal if no hostiles are near. So now I can confuse native creatures. Interesting. That's not gonna open. No. It's locked down. So it actually looks like this is where we were supposed to go then. Am I right? What was the other way? The other way I ignored. It was the stormtrooper here. I guess there was nothing there because there was a stormtrooper. I ignored him. I right, fuck it. I'll just keep going. I don't. I'm not gonna keep backtracking or anything. Zayo says you can reflect the. Uh, you can reflect the shots back with the double saber. Yeah, but don't you have to unlock it? And I didn't unlock anything with the double saber stance yet. I've only unlocked everything with this. The dual saber, not the double saber. It seems the dual saber is better for like the melee combat, while the du the du uh, dual saber is good for. They really want me to do this, huh? Nice. You see how stupid that just looked? He pushed the guy, and the guy didn't even react. What just happened? He disappeared. What the fuck? The enemy disappeared. What is with this game? He literally just vanished from existence. <laughs> what a great game. Amazing. Oh my god. He literally is, look, he's just gone from the game. As if he never existed. He just... I wish I was making this shit up. But this game is so unpolished, it's ridiculous, it's hard to enjoy it. You know? That could be trouble. Or maybe it could let He's talking play. about a creature that's not here. He's talking about the creature we already mind controlled. <laughs> what the frick happened with this game? This will be fun. 
Unreal. The Empire is way out of their element here. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. Found a chest. Oh, can we platform across here? Look at those. Yeah, what is that? I don't know. Let's do this first. We got a tactical... Ooh. Tactical material for a shirt. Oh, no. It's crashing. It's fucking crashing again. You've got to be fucking shitting me. First the hunter pants. Now the tactical shirt material. You've got to be kidding me, dude. Dude, this game is unbearably buggy. Are you kidding me? It's getting to the point like I don't want to play it anymore. I gave it a chance. Like literally, I gave it a chance. It's been a week. Over a week. And the game is still dog shit, man. Oh my god, man. Why is this so bad? Why is it so bad? And ours is like the patch made even more problems. First hunter pants. Now, what was that? Technical shirt? <laughs> How does the fucking equipment crash the game? What the fucking shit? Anyway, American MAGA Undertaker did a super chat. He said, make games great again. Dude. Usually I don't like political memes, but Jesus Christ, man. You're getting to a point it's like, come on. I'm going to call you AMU, American Manga Undertaker, if you don't mind. That way it's not just, you know, stretching out the leaderboard. I was going to say, now look where they make me restart from. Right? Like, I did something fucking wrong. And now I got to redo this whole segment. Because these idiots fucked the game up. Like, jeez, man. What, what, okay, will he, will he disappear again? What do you think? Will he disappear again? Now he didn't disappear. <laughs> now I actually have to fight him. I don't know if I'm supposed to push or pull when he does that. I'm supposed to do one of them. I don't know if one. Wow, look at that great animation that I can't see. Because the camera is in the wall. The Empire is way out of Oh god, reality. look at that death animation. What is dude what? This is supposed to be a triple A game. Look at this. He's floating. Dude, did they even try? What the fuck, man? Look at that. So I want you to think about this. Within a three minute period, we had a, disapp a disappearing creature. We had a shirt freeze my game and crash it. And then we had a, f a fucked up floating creature. Like... You can't make this shit up. Look at those. They fucked the game up ba big time. Here it is. The tactical shirt. Sure. No. I can change my survivor colors. Can I change? I can't change my hunter pants colors. Didn't they say material or something? I don't even get it. Like, it says new. New what? I don't even know. Oh, here it is. Tactical jacket. Look. So now you can change... See that? You can change the stuff on your jacket. See that? To different color schemes. I see. We'll do that. How does it look now? It looks completely different. Look at that. It would have been nice if it didn't if it worked, you know. 
What the f you can't grab that? What's the point of it if you can't jump and grab it? Because it seems like it should be making a shortcut. See that? Like a shortcut across. But you can't interact with it. I don't get it. <clears throat> Whatever. I tried. I don't understand it. It didn't seem to activate. Oh yeah, yeah. This game, man. I don't know. It's just, it's such an unpolished game, unfinished, wonky madness, right? Shitty, shitty. Supposed to be triple A. It's shit. Uh, I guess I'm grabbing the vine over there. Ready? Oh, you're grabbing the grind on the ceiling, actually. All right. And I'm still playing. I mean, I spent seventy dollars. Would you like me to just quit it right now and say fuck this game and never play it again? Is that what you're saying? Like, is that literally what you guys are telling me? Just don't play it anymore because the game sucks. <laughs> Everyone's saying yes, quit it. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. going on here oh look we went to 30 frames how nice a 30 frame cutscene you got a nice mustache I don't know what else to say see her I, I I thought no you didn't think you perceived a threat and reacted if the order had reacted faster we'd still have a republic the Empire the hack scene look everything's crew. popping Half in around the them. Wants us dead. <laughs> yes Gods are against us, but they will always be against us. Dude, everything is popping in. Fight your way out of some situations. Tame the Relter. Go back to thirty frames. Tame the Relter in thirty frames. There we go. You can now glide with relters. Oh boy. Now this is more my speed. Oh shit. Oh no. No, Relter! Relter! Relter, help me! I'll get the hang of this. Well, we're in another area now, right? From what I can see. I don't think we've been here yet. Shortcut unlocked. Here we are. Okay. Uh, by the way, before we continue here, there's some enemies over there. I received a $20 tip. And it is from One Minute Man. Thank you so much to One Minute Man, as always, for your daily support of my content and my streams. This is by far my biggest contribution that I've received today so far. And I very much appreciate that, One Minute Man, so thank you. And let's get you up on the leaderboard. Guys, I, I understand the game is unpolished, but I would hope that you're still having a good time here with me as I uh, 
attempt to continue the playthrough. I guess today we'll have to talk about if you guys want to keep seeing it or not, right? I mean, we do have a new game coming out Friday, Zelda. And we do have the Elden Ring playthrough that I'm continuing on with. I guess the question is, do you want to see me continue to do this? And the sad fact is, I mean, it's, it, I feel like it's wasted money. Like, I feel like they really ruined their own game with such lack of polish and detail and, and just so many issues. Because I don't think the game is bad. I think the execution is bad. You know what I mean? And that's sad. It would be one thing if the game were bad. But the game is not bad. The idea of the game is good. The plot is pretty good. But the execution is so pathetically bad that it makes it hard to really care about the game. I mean, i just been playing for a half an hour. We already experienced three awful game bugs. I'm going to do this. Ready? Damn, that was a pretty brutal death. I pushed him off, and he got eaten by the blue shit. That's kind of messed up, actually, but hey. Maybe you're trying to be a Sith. I don't know. Okay. Oh. A lot of guys here. There's quite a few guys here, actually. Hmm. not hitting him. It won't reflect to him for some reason. Even though I have the ability to reflect to him, it won't do it. There. It finally worked. Weird. So I must have to find a way to get up there. Here we go. The wall run. Okay. Casanova says, when Cyberpunk released, we were all allowed to receive refunds. You know, Microsoft did a similar thing uh, with Garbage Redfall. Oh, I don't know about Redfall. But there's no way they're going to give me a refund for this game. This game I already had for over a week. Even though I didn't really play it that much, there's no way they're going to give me a refund for it now. Redfall, you know, was Game Pass, so I doubt anyone got refunds because no one bought it. How's the blue stuff not eating him? It doesn't even make sense. I push him into the blue shit. He doesn't do anything. So weird. I push him into it two times. It did no damage to him. The game is so wonky, man. Find something? What'd you find? Alright, what we should do is keep rotating and just do all four directions, right? <clears throat> Absolutely we should. Gotta free the bird. The bird is the word. That did the trick. Let's move. Good. So I have two different ways to go. I think this way will lead me back to the central area. So if I want to go do the save point there, we could do it. There's also, if I do this, I might be able to climb up here. But I guess that, I don't think this opens, right? This looks locked. Probably a way to get back later. Yep, there's a way to get back later. Okay. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word, bird, 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 bird. Let's go this way so we can save again. This is the save point over here. What just happened? I don't know what just happened. He, put, he pulled something out. 
exchange for reward at a vendor? Where did it even come from? An item? There was apparently an item that I picked up by accident. I didn't even mean to do so. Toss me a stick, and, buddy. and he started looking at it when enemies were attacking him. This is the weirdest fucking game, man. So, okay, so this I can't, still can't do yet. See that there's an item there? There must be a way later on to control the beams even further so that you can, like, divert them. See that? And, like, like break other things. Because right now, like, if I do this, now nah, it doesn't do anything, see? I was thinking maybe I could divert the beam to do something, but it doesn't. No. So there's got to be a way to do something with this later. Because right now I can't target or do anything with it. There must be a way to do that later. All right, let's uh, <clears throat> let's sit and rest, and then we're gonna go back, and we're gonna go to the new area. Rest up. Okay. There we go. <clears throat> there we go. Killing you. <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, I'm on vacation. I decided to go to the planet of blue blue dots for my vacation. Do things about it. Oh, what the? Totally not what I wanted. Jeez. Totally because the camera screwed up. You'd rather see Redfall? Ramrod, no, you would not. Redfall's worse than this by by a mile. It's such a bad game. It's it, That game... Like, this game is finished, but not polished. Redfall literally isn't even a finished game. It's it, There's not even, like, a game there. What am I doing? I'm dropping. Oh. How are they selling them at full retail? It's a great question, because they really shouldn't be. They should not be selling these games at full retail. They're not they're not finished games at all. So now you can change the hunter pants color. See this? There we go. How exciting. It's got dancing. We got a dancing fool creature here. Dancing. You fucker. I don't know how I just did that. <laughs> Let it flip. Jeez. What the fuck? What? Where did this come from? Huh? I literally have no idea what's going on. Where the fuck did this creature come from? <laughs> what is happening in this fucking game, man? It appeared literally out of nowhere. Like, just zoop, it's just there, there for no reason. Like, okay. Downstairs. How could it have come from downstairs if it's if the blue shit is here? The blue stuff should have killed it. Stupid idiot. <laughs> Alright, so this is where we just were. It's the shortcut. Okay. Well, we made it. Took a little while. But we did make it here. Is this an area down here? Yeah, it is. It's called an Invisible Wall Death because the game is stupid. Jeez, this game is dumb, man. Invisible fucking wall death. You stupid game. Nothing else out here? I guess not. Maybe there is, but you have to get rid of the blue stuff first or something. I need a stim, buddy. That did the trick.
Ugh. We need a ball. Where do I get a ball? Uh, I guess we have to take it out of the central array. Yep, I guess we don't need this anymore. Am I enjoying it? Here's the thing. I've played far worse. And I guess that's kind of sad. I've definitely played far worse games than this. It's not a... Like I said, it's not the gameplay that's not enjoyable. It's the wonkiness of the game. The fact that it com feels completely and utterly unfinished. And, and just, like, buggy... And, and not polished. If the game was polished, it'd probably be amazing game of the year stuff. Yeah, but the fact that there's so many problems with it We're getting close. makes you feel like, you know, it's hard to enjoy it for what they intended it to be when it's not what they intended it to be. You see what I'm saying? What the fuck am I supposed to do now? Uh... I can't fall two feet off the side? What the fuck do you want me to do? Really? Dex says it's kind of weird this game is the opposite of most. In most games, the the uh, first half is good, the end is horrible. In this game, the whole first half is bad and the, the end is quite good. That's what I'm being told. If I tough through the first half, the rest of the game is good. What do I even do right now? Look, I can't... There's nothing to do here. Oh, look! Uh, it's not working. Look, it's broken. We're not the only ones interested in the array. Searched all over the array, buddy. This is our last stop. If the key to Tantalor is real, it has to be here. And if not, maybe Z does have a screw loose. Alright. First of all, we have a save point, and it's good because I have a tip that I need to shout out. <clears throat> Focus. Okay. I received a $4.20 tip. From Usher. To Jedi Survivor. You remind me of a game that I once knew. Only is that it worked much better than you. It was polished and it had fun gameplay too. This is why I can't keep playing with you. Alright. Very nice. <laughs> well, thank you, Usher, for the $4.20 tip. I appreciate that very much. You know it's rare when you can say that a sequel is definitively stepped backward from the first, but... Hey. That seal looks familiar. That seal yeah, looks familiar? Centauri Kree intended to set Z. Keep the Tandalore was sealed away centuries now. <clears throat> He's slicing. He's dicing. Sounds like the array is powering up. There's some answers. Oh, man. Oh.
great. It's gonna be a clone, isn't it? A fucking clone or something. <clears throat> Giant enemy crab, I will see you later. He's hopefully the cutscene doesn't brick your micro your Microsoft Welcome Series to X. Channel lore. <laughs> It's beautiful. Remind me not to let you name the next world we discover. <laughs> Give it time. You didn't like me much at first either. Jury's still out. <laughs> <sighs> Hard to believe this paradise was hiding on just the other side of the abyss. Come on. I want to show you something. Renowned Jedi Knight Dagging Gara offers to be my escort on an uncharted world. <laughs> How could I refuse? Like this. Without no. your guidance, I'd never have made it here in one piece. Oh, careful now. Or well, someone might think you've learned humility. How dare you? That's a great insult to my, my people to say that. We pride ourselves on our egotistical nature. So if you say I'm, hum uh, you know, if I'm, in, if I'm in, uh, humble, what a great insult. Anyway, where am? Wait, where did I go? What the hell? Force is strong here. It's just as I told you. We'll build the Push temple them off. here. <clears throat> yes. My thoughts exactly. So you're still in the flashback. The, the pretty graphics of the flashback. Do you think there's any, uh... <clears throat> any items or anything in this area? Look at that. Hey. What the heck? Where am I now? Oh, wow. They totally don't let you go where you want. You have to go where they're gu guiding you in this memory. Simply wonderful. Yes, it's perfect. I've seen the galaxy, Santari. And there are many worlds that the light of the Jedi does not reach. Hmm. I'm going to petition the High Council to train initiates here. Fontana Lord. But it can be so challenging to access. What if something were to go wrong? Our temple will be a bastion for the Order. Here at the galactic frontier. The Abyss blocks comm signals. We'll have to invite a member of the Jedi Council to visit in person. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> it looks like there was already like a temple there. You see that? Here we are. They've been in there for hours. Council members are not known for their hasty judgments. Especially Master Rancesis. My duel with the Gendai didn't take this long. <laughs> you won in the end. Be patient. Not one of my strong suits. Well, if you're going to teach younglings, you had better learn. Younglings? I have to teach younglings? Oh shit, I quit. I don't know about that. I have Jay loves you. Cal's new look. Yeah, he changed how he looks today. So does the council. Trust them to do the right thing. Yeah, I wanted to touch your arm. Uh-oh. You're in big trouble. Warn the others. We're under attack. They're coming for you. Uh, what are you gonna do? Hit the fucking spaceships with your lightsaber from here? <laughs> What was that for? You're not here. Huh. You're not supposed to be here. The hell? What the heck? Release me. Please. What the heck? 
How did the memory... Oh, because he's there. Oh, shit. That's him. So they captured him and cryogenically froze him, it looks like. Not cryogenic, I guess. It's, he's actually in this liquid shit. Huh. Is that a lightsaber? That's a weird lightsaber. Look at that. He's like, thanks, I'll be stealing this from you now. Jeez, how long was he here? Looks like Sephiroth. Haha, <laughs> he does! It's Jedi Sephiroth. Missing an arm. They chopped his arm off, huh? <clears throat> huh. Well, I don't know about this guy being good. He doesn't look like a good guy to me. He's like stereotypical evil looking, right? Yes. I am back. The order is gone. I must return to Tanlor. What happened there? How'd you end up here? We were invaded. I held them at bay as long as I could, but... There were too many. The battle was horrific. Still, we weren't beaten. Not yet. Not until the Jedi Council gave the order to abandon Tanalor and then refused to counterattack. Huh. They gave up on it? Yes. It was my discovery! My home, and they just expected me to throw it away! Dagon, wait. I refused to obey and was betrayed by the one I trusted most! No, stop! <laughs> <laughs> What have you done? He corrupted his crystal. <clears throat> I told you he looked evil. Yeah. 
So complex. I've never seen gameplay so complex before. <laughs> Is that it? Meager. Such a chore. <laughs> We're all that's left. What happened to you? Ah, oh, Ravis. I should have known you would honor your oath. <laughs> Wait! You gotta love how the villain always has this charismatic laugh. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> so, it's sending a signal now? The key to Tantalor. Could Kree have met Dagon? How could she entrust Tantalor to someone like him? Bacta is a substance used galaxy-wide to aid in healing and recovery. A patient is suspended, usually unconscious, in the liquid for more or more extended sessions. The viscous substance aids in the regeneration of muscle tissue and nerves. So he was probably in there for years and years and years, right? Hmm. All right. Well, that's our first hour of gameplay for today. Uh, three or four major bugs <laughs> in the first hour. I guess we'll see how the rest of today goes. Uh, I hate to be say it, but a lot of people don't seem to be very excited for the rest of this game, which, you know, again, it sucks. Like, I feel like it's just picking up and getting good, but the unpolished nature of the game does make it hard to like, you know, but, uh, all right, continue on. Thank you all. Uh, excuse me. All right, so we have hit 100 likes on the stream, and because of that, I'm going to go ahead and do a, a nice uh, bubble blow for you guys to say thank you. I'm trying to find the appropriate thing. Here it is, right? So thank you for that. Um, if you guys are having a good time, please support the stream in any way possible. The likes is definitely one. If you haven't liked the stream yet, what are you waiting for, right? Um, by the way, there's a stupid idiot here. Let me get rid of them. <laughs> okay. Um, let's do a celebratory bubble blow, shall we? That's it? Try again. I think I blew too hard. There we go. That was better. Now there's bubbles all in the room. Jasper's watching them float around. <laughs> He's going, hoo, hoo, hoo. Look at all the bubbles. The bubbles, Jasper. I'm glad you're not afraid of them anymore. He used to be afraid of them and run from them. Very good. Okay. So, thank you guys. So far, so good. We'll play for another hour before we actually go on our formal break of the stream. <clears throat> which, there will actually be a formal break today. I know yesterday we didn't do one. We will do a formal break today. Um, now, guys, again, it would be nice if you could support the stream in any way. Whether that means liking the stream if you haven't yet, please do. Whether that means a, a super chat, a super sticker, a membership, a gifted membership, a tip, all appreciated. Uh, it would be great if you could support. I know people are disappointed with the game. I mean, me too. Again, if the game were more polished, it would be so much better of an experience. But we're just having all these silly wonky bugs and things, you know. 
It is what it is, but I'm going to keep going for today anyway. I think we need to kind of think about it. And this week, this coming week, do you want to see this continue? Or after today, I guess maybe we'll make a judgment, right? All right, let's, let's keep going, okay? All right, so we freed a Jedi that was trapped who then apparently went Sith mode. Oh, uh, that's always good. Let's go ahead and get this. It appears to be another upgrade, right? Health essence acquired. Maximum health has now been increased.